Hi James, just to go over today's lesson once again for you. Uh, if we look at the main footage here on the left, good setup position, much better takeaway than last lesson. Really good position at the top, nice and compact, nice and strong. And from there, there's just that element of a move that you were feeling over the top as the club steepens fractionally at the start of your downswing. That results in a swing to the left which lacks for um, rotation. Now what we did do is took a little bit of an unusual view of the golf swing and we've got some footage here of Tiger from directly in front of him as he's hitting the golf shot. And we can see that as he comes through the right arm is working higher through the ball and the forearms rotating cause helping the ball to start to the right and curve back to the left. You can see there are much better forearm rotation, higher position of the arms coming through the body as opposed to what we've got here on the left, which are the arms working left and underneath the chest, if you will, holding the club off with no release. If we then look at the work that you did on the explainer, and you can start to see that when we were trying to put the, the roller onto the fin, we get that much better right arm position through the ball. You can see there that the right arm works high across the chest, and you're putting the roller onto that fin, it gets you that nice high through the ball position with a good forearm rotation that's apparent in Tiger Swing. So good luck with it. Uh, what we want to start to see is that ball starting off to the right a fraction and then bending gently to the left. Good luck and see you soon.